so that they cover crowdfunding platforms and the payment service providers they use. These changes cover all forms of transactions, including digital assets, such as cryptocurrencies. The illegal blockades have highlighted the fact that crowdfunding platforms and some of the payment service providers they use are not fully captured under the Proceeds of Crime and Terrorist Financing Act. Our banks and financial institutions are already obligated to report to the Financial Transactions and Reports Analysis Centre of Canada, or FinTrack. As of today, all crowdfunding platforms and the payment service providers they use must register with FinTrack and they must report large and suspicious transactions to FinTrack. This will help mitigate the risk that these platforms receive illicit funds, increase the quality and quantity of intelligence received by FinTrack, and make more information available to support investigations by law enforcement into these illegal blockades. We are making these changes because we know that these platforms are being used to support illegal blockades and illegal activity, which is damaging the Canadian economy. The government will also bring forward legislation to provide these authorities to FinTrack on a permanent basis. Second, the government is issuing an order with immediate effect under the Emergencies Act authorizing Canadian financial institutions to temporarily cease providing financial services where the institution suspects that an account is being used to further the illegal blockades and occupations. This order covers both personal and corporate accounts. Third, we are directing Canadian financial institutions to review their relationships with anyone involved in the illegal blockades and report to the RCMP or CSIS. As of today, a bank or other financial service provider will be able to immediately freeze or suspend an account without a court order. In doing so, they will be protected against civil liability for actions taken in good faith. Federal government institutions will have a new broad authority to share relevant information with banks and other financial service providers to ensure that we can all work together to put a stop to the funding of these illegal blockades. This is about following the money. This is about stopping the financing of these illegal blockades. We are today serving notice. If your truck is being used in these illegal blockades, your corporate accounts will be frozen.